Hello, this is Tavita, and we are at the Woodstock Film Festival at the screening of The Messenger by director Oren Moverman. Well, this is my first time here. Uh, I've heard about it. Um, I have a good friend who used to come here. It was his favorite festival, and, and he died a couple years ago, and they give an award in his name. His name is Jim Lyons. So I am, I've always been kind of uh, partial to this festival, even without being here. Um, it's a great location to do it. It's, you know, it's a great vibe of, of the place. So I'm going to answer that question after the screening tonight when I tell you how it went. But uh, overall, we're just you know, happy to be here. Thank you. Oh. The perfect yeah. candles. <laughs> I think I have that shirt. Hey. 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 Thank you. Thank you, guys. Please come up. Thank you, Kate. And thank you so much, all of you, to, for coming here. Um, and now I would like to pass the mic to Rob. That was fine. It was, uh, it was really um, amazing. And I... When Oren offered me this part, I, I actually, I, I tried to talk him out of it, I, and I also lobbied for another part, um, uh, because I think I was actually uh, afraid to, to really, to, to go to the places that I, that I knew that you would want me to go to, to uh, play this role, but I'm glad that you, that you were steadfast and you said, no, you have to play this role. And I love working with these, with these guys. And, um, and I'm so proud of Oren for making this film. You know, the, when I read this film, I thought it was one of the most beautiful, eloquent um, statements, not so, not overtly against the war, but, you know, just to show an aspect of it that really, I think, everybody needs to see and that the army got behind it because they want people to know about you know they want uh, i think they want people more than just the people who generally get who are getting notified to know about this and uh i was really i was so moved by it and um you know i i felt really lucky to do it um so there was no rehearsal there was some some idea of blocking but basically um you know nobody really knew what the other person is going to do and so we need a lot of freedom to to be able to move around and um, get closer to the actors and, and move away just emotionally this is very well tell me about this so editing a character driven piece you know this is not about this is not about cutting away or, or, or fancy anything it's really letting the performances rule the film so you as an editor who editors tend to like to cut so, you know, especially in our, you know, 200 minute scene in the kitchen, how do you, you know, how did you think about this and just letting the performances? Well, I'm, I'm especially proud of the fact that the, the, the scene that everyone loves the most in the movie has no edits. <laughs> 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 that, that means I did my job well. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, it wasn't about intellectualizing it, it was just about the heart and about you know, what we felt watching that. And that was the decision, there was nothing else, you know, there was no debate. And later we watched the other takes and it was like, yeah, they're fine, they're better. Technically, they might be better, but they weren't the take, you know. And that went through the whole, the whole film, it was just about you know, getting out of the way and, and making sure that the story was being told and the characters were coming through and, yeah. you know. I hope so. Well, thank you all and thank you all. Very much. I'd like to thank, first of all, before everybody goes, I'd like to thank uh, Oscilloscope Laboratories for bringing the film to us. And I wish them a lot of luck with it out there. I'd like to thank uh, the ladies' guild of the
America is for uh, helping us with Robert Tell and the screening and to all these remarkable young men. Thank you so much for making this great film. Do you think this film festival is different than others and you, it will really help you out? the film out? I don't know. I mean, there's a lot of film festivals and I'm glad. I'm, you know, um, I think that uh, the Woodstock Film Festival, uh, they really champion independent film and so that's why I like it and I know that there's others across the country and for some films, uh, this is the only way an audience will actually see, see a film. So, um, uh, so whenever I can, I try and support the film festivals and uh, I'm always honored that the that the Woodstock uh, f festival includes anything that uh, I'm in really impressed with the audiences uh, very present audience really intelligent uh, and emotionally rooted not just the intelligentsia cynics so it was nice to have a dialogue with uh, with the audience they seem to respond which feels good and just coming outside of a Q&A, the audience here felt very, uh, just very present and seemed to want to be there and asked interesting questions and seemed to have a lot of care. And there's a, a very familial uh, quality to, to, to these spaces here. So, so far, yeah, this, is, this seems like a great festival. It's my first time. You just popped my cherry, so thank you. <laughs>